Madam Speaker, much more work is indeed needed because this seventh Closing the Gap report is in many respects profoundly disappointing. Despite the concerted efforts of successive governments since the first report, we are not on track to achieve most of the targets. There are some improvements in education and health outcomes. We are on track to halve the gap in Year 12 attainment rates for Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islanders aged 20 to 24. The target to halve the gap in mortality rates for Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander children does look achievable by 2018. The new target of closing the school attendance gap within five years should be achievable, and I do look forward to reporting good results on this in the years to come. However, the other targets, to close the gap in life expectancy within a generation, to ensure access to early childhood education for all Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander four-year-olds in remote areas, to halve the gap in reading and numeracy uh, for Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander students, and to halve the gaps in employment outcomes have either not been met or are not on track to be met.